It is the hottest new beauty trend in Hollywood. The vampire facelift has a creepy name, but it's all the rage in wrinkle fighting tonight. How it works and if it's worth the money. We often look to celebrities for the latest, greatest fountain of youth. Kim Kardashian put vampire facelifts front and center when she braved the blood-based procedure on her own reality show. Oh my God, I will never get a facelift if it feels like that. Now a handful of Austin doctors are riding the vampire facelift wave. Carol Burnett came here to Westlake Dermatology to try the beauty boost because she's closing in on a big birthday. I'm about to be 40. Uh, fine lines, wrinkles, um, just improving my complexion overall, and you know, just helping ease in to aging <laughs> as much as possible. It starts with applying numbing cream all over your face. While that goes to work, blood is drawn from your arm. Doing okay. Your blood is spun in a centrifuge with special gel that separates the cells from the plasma. That platelet-rich plasma is then mixed with calcium and funneled into your face. It's working by taking your body's own plasma and we are re-injecting it or we're penetrating it into multiple layers of the skin through a microneedling device. It's a bit of a bloody mess as the tiny needles inject the special serum into your face, but Carol says she doesn't feel a thing and she much prefers using her body's blood to man-made fillers like Botox. That was what was very refreshing about hearing about this was that I actually get to use me <laughs> to fight my own age, so that, that was a bonus. It's certainly one of the big cells of the procedure. We're told there's less risk of infection or allergic reaction when using your own blood. The redness you see on Carol's face during the treatment is typically gone in about a day. After four to six weeks, most people see a visible improvement in fine lines and wrinkles. So if the name vampire and using your own true blood sound inviting? You have to invite me in. Consider this one more weapon in the war on aging skin. This procedure costs about $600 a treatment. To get those longer lasting results, three to four treatments are suggested at least a month apart. Now, mainstream medicine hasn't really embraced this vampire technique, mainly because there are no real large head-to-head -head studies showing how well injecting plasma compares to other FDA-approved fillers with a longer track record.